Hey guys, and welcome back to a new video. Uh, apologies for the delay in content. We obviously haven't had any new product to review uh, coming out from a retail standpoint, and unfortunately just haven't had the funds to pick up any of the hobby products like Don Russ Elite and Don Russ. So in times like these, I guess we just have to switch it up a bit. So today we're just gonna do a bit of a blaster battle. So we've got here three different blasters from uh, last year's class and one from this year, sorry. So two from last year and one from this year. And so, yeah, just a mix up of some blasters, just a couple products here that I haven't actually opened too much of, and then a bit of a throwback to one of the um, original products of last year with the contenders. So, yeah, really, it's just a look at three products. It's a chance to rip some stuff, um, and we might as well chuck it on camera for you. So, yeah, like I said, three boxes here. I think the order that we'll go with will be contenders 2021 first, uh, then we'll go with the hoops for this year, and then we'll finish with the mosaic. Uh, just because Mosaic here is probably the most valuable of the three products and probably the most highly anticipated from myself from opening here. So yeah, we'll we'll move uh, the rest off the, off the screen here. We'll start off with the Contenders Blaster and we'll kind of chat about the product as we go because I don't think we ended up reviewing this product. Um, so here we've got Pretending Contenders 2021. Uh, this is retail. Got a bit of a ding here too, so kind of was going to hold this um, for a while, but figured with that ding we might as well just open her up. Um, Contenders is a really funny product for me, I think uh, from a retail standpoint. Um, it can be quite a boring product, but there is huge potential with some of the hits that you could get. So you can get really um, full-on rookie autos uh, in Contenders retail, but it is just really hard to hit them basically. The production levels must be quite high for these. Um, but yeah, you are guaranteed a hit, so you'll get an auto or a meme. It'll most likely be a rookie uh, meme card. But that's the one guarantee across the three blasters we're opening today. This is actually the only one with a guarantee. So we'll just open her up and uh, get into it and we'll see what we can find. Just find a good spot to sort of slip the pin there. So yeah, it would be pretty cool to hit an auto um, or one of the really low numbered uh, variants throughout the product. Because um, it has got quite an extensive set uh, checklist, but yeah, unfortunately... With like most retail, I haven't had too much luck with uh, contenders retail. So empty box there. So you do get uh, five packs, but eight cards per pack, and I believe you might get one or two non-base uh, per pack. That one there feels thicker, so I'm going to say that probably has a jersey card in it. So we'll go for that. That at the end. There we go. Great start though with the Stephen Adams. There's the base set, if you haven't seen it already, but I'm sure you have. Quite a short veteran base set, um, but quite, uh, you know, good quality players, I guess, throughout. So we'll just get through the base here. There we go. Looks like we've just got an insert on the back, and it is a game night insert. And that is Anthony Davis, so that's one of the insert sets there. Not a bad looking set, to be fair. Anthony Davis there, so you can get uh, unnumbered parallels on these insert sets. Um, the only rookie cards you'll get will be either the hits or the uh, um, Class of 2020 sort of card, which hopefully we'll get one to show you. So I'll work through our base here. Oh, here we go. So we've got a... See here we actually have two um, non-base. So we'll put the base to the side. Looks like we have a Giannis. So that is a Giannis Red. That's the game ticket, so that's just an unnumbered parallel. You've got that red foil, and we've got a class of 2020. You've got a Malachi Flynn. So that's the, basically the base rookie card from Contenders Retail. So that was that pack there. But yeah, like I said, it would be cool to hit something special, but yeah, you don't hold, hold, hold out too much hope with a product like this, but the products do only get more exciting throughout this video. So that is a positive. Looks like we've got another game night on the back here. It could be a red parallel game night. Yep, so that's a Trey Young. And that is the red parallel. As you can see, the bit of red foil down there. A bit of a color match, I guess, for the Hawks. Take that. All right, we'll get through our base again. Looks like we've got a red something. There are international ticket cards. It might be one of those. Nope, it is a red Michael Porter Jr. game ticket. And we have a, it looks like that might be an international ticket of Pascal Siakam. So I do like this set. I think that's quite clever, the way they've done that. So we'll 
just move those in there. And this is our last pack here. So this should have a jersey card, I'd say, if I had to guess correctly. Oh, no, sorry. Sorry to bump the camera. We might have an auto. Um, yeah, we might have an auto there. All right, get through the base. Go from the back, have a red foil draft class, so the red parallel of the Udoka rookie. And we'll see if we can figure out the team on this auto. Um, go from the top. Now that's going to show me who it is. Oh well. Alright. Naji Marshall, rookie ticket auto. So it is a sticker auto, um, it's not on card like on uh, most um, contenders hobby, sorry, but pretty clean card and we'll take a rookie auto. Um, Najee Marshall, he does play for the Pals, I haven't kept up with him too much lately, but he does get game time, so that's the base uh, unnumbered rookie ticket auto for Najee Marshall, so pop that over there. Pretty cool. Alright, that's the first box out of the way, we will cut and we'll bring the next one on track. All right, so we'll get into the Hoops Blaster now. We'll just get the uh, seal off and then we can chat a bit more about the product. So yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty surprised to hit that Rookie Auto, uh, albeit a not a huge player, but we'll definitely take it. Good start uh, for the Contenders box. It definitely needed a bit of luck um, to have any chance in this battle. So we'll just pop the packs over to the top left there. So Hoops Hoops Blaster 2022, or whatever you want to call it, Kate Cunningham class. So let's run through the hits potentially. So you can obviously get the retail exclusive slams. They're a big chase. Uh, I've actually opened, I believe, three of these blasters already, and I've only got uh, one slam, or maybe I've opened two. Um, you can get rookies, you can get... Uh, um, sorry, or you can get rookies and you can get uh, numbered cards to 75, which are reds. Um, you can also get uh, jersey cards numbered to 25 or just the base jersey cards. But uh, for this year round, they are not numbered. So interesting decision um, from Panini there. But sort of, I think I said that in the last video, I actually kind of like that you're not guaranteed something because then you just kind of go with it and see what you get. So we'll look here. Doesn't look like there's a thick pack to me. But we'll just have to go through them. So yeah, a lot more packs this time around um, with the eight, 88 cards throughout the box. So we'll just try and fly through that base as per usual. Looks like we've got a blue here, which is a, I believe, a retail unnumbered parallel. Oh, okay. Jonathan Kaminga, blue. So very decent rookie to get and color match blue. We'll, we'll take it. We'll definitely take it with a Kessler Edwards to finish there as well. That's probably, I, I believe I didn't get any rookie parallels in my other two hoops blasters that I opened. I could be incorrect there, but I believe that's the case. So we'll definitely take that. Um, David Johnson on the back there. And hoping this could be a slam. What do we got? That looks like a slam to me, but unfortunately I think it might be the one I've already got. It is. <laughs> the Derek Rose slam. I do like that card a lot, but I do. Uh, that is the one slam I have actually already pulled. So what are the chances in that? But it's all right. Very solid start. Alrighty. So I've got another blue. Pop those there. Get from the back. There is the base Kaminga. That's pretty cool. Pop them over there too. And the blue is a veteran Harrison Barnes. Yeah, so I'd love a hollow slam of a good player. Um, and other than that, I'm just looking to get inserts for the guys I, I collect and just build up that stash of the New Year's rookies, basically. Sort of what Hoops achieves for me. So I've got a purple, Paul George purple, pretty cool. Aiden will enjoy that one. And a Jaden Springer. There's the purple PG, pretty nice. Let's 
looks like we have an insert here. Go from the back, there's Josh Christopher for the Rockets, and the insert is an arriving now of Corey Kispert. It's a nice one. I do like the yellow hits on the arriving now. I think it's a cool, cool set for sure. Sorry, apologies. That pack just decided to be very stubborn. Alright. From the back, an Evan Mobley. Very good rookie to get. And it looks like it could be a sky view. It is of Kyrie Irving. I don't mind the sky view. I was lucky enough to pull the Skyview Hollow of Lamello. Nice second year insert. Alright. From the back, Scotty Lewis. Speaking of Hornets. And a pure water of Steph Curry, which I already have also. But that is a cool insert for sure. Anytime you got water on an insert, I find they they managed to pull it off quite well, so. That's a very cool one. Pop that to the side, actually. Might have a blue in here. Oh, went a bit early there, sorry. The blue is a Rui Hashimura. And the rookie is Moses Moody. All right, class three packs of the hoops. Um, found very solid, very, very good start. Um, we'll have to see what comes of the rest of this pack box, but um, definitely off to a strong start and hasn't really done too much since then. Uh, Alperen Singoon there. And a purple... Oh, there we go. So there's no um, no suspense there. That is a purple Josh Giddy. Uh, I think it's safe to say that's even better than the uh, blue Kaminga. That's a pretty cool card to get for sure. I would have no idea guessing the value. Don't want to overestimate it all, but um, that's a very cool card. I know there's definitely some serious giddy collectors out there. Um, so to get a parallel of him uh, is pretty cool, especially after not really having much luck with any of your parallels of late. Um, we'll definitely take that. All right, got an insert coming up. Go from the back. It is a Sharif Cooper. And then at the back there, oh nice, class of 2021, Evan Mobley, pretty cool, I do have the Cade Cunningham uh, Pistons one of those, so that's nice, and you'll notice we haven't had an auto or a jersey card, and there's definitely no jersey card in here, so um, yeah, that's just the different sort of life of uh, hoops, given that there's no guaranteed hits, so it doesn't look like we're going to get an auto. I believe that's a lights camera action back there. I've got Bones Highland. And the final card of the hoops box is a Zach Levine lights camera action. So yeah, no hollow in there either, but um, definitely can't complain with those hits. So you'll see them all in the recap anyway. Um, we'll clear this off and we'll get the mosaic done. All right, so now onto the final course. Um, as I said earlier, Mosaic is probably my most highly anticipated of these boxes, but yeah, the Blasters so far have definitely delivered with at least some um, interesting stuff, so we'll definitely take it. Um, uh, mosaic Blaster, you can get four Mosaic Prisms in there. You can also hit the number to 25 Orange Fluorescence, so that would be a huge, uh, huge hit. And then Genesis as well is obviously a big look for. Um, you can get Autos and just all in all, just some cool stuff. I do love the Mosaic sets, the way that they have the sort of subsets mixed in there. Uh, sort of makes you feel like you're getting a bit of everything, so you're not sort of getting just one, you know, one rookie card per pack or one insert per, per pack. Uh, kind of thing. So there are eight packs, I believe, with four cards per. So let's tuck in. Um, would love to hit a Genesis, obviously, uh, or a numbered card would be great too, but we'll just see what we get. All right, Kyle Kuzma. Got a green in the back there. Julius Randall. And there's an Anthony Davis, National Pride. And the green is an insert. It is an Elevate Donovan Mitchell green. Pretty cool. All 
Alrighty, another green in the back by the looks. Troy Brown Jr. Jarrett Culver. There's a rookie, first rookie of the box, Malachi Flynn. And the green is an all-time greats of Magic Johnson. It's pretty nice. Alright, let's heat up a bit. Let's get something, something to write home about. Obviously, always looking for Maxi and, and that kind of thing, but we'll just see what we get. Bertans, DeMar DeRozan, while he's still on the Spurs, a rookie uh, NBA debut rookie of Naismith, and a Jam Masters of LeBron James. That's pretty cool. Definitely a cool one to get. Uh, the Jam Masters is a very interesting set, but yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. The LeBron Jam Masters will definitely take that. I'd love to get a Bang LeBron. The Bang set is one that I'm definitely chasing. All right, we've got RJ Barrett, OG, Zeke Naji rookie, and a Mosaic on the back. It's not a rookie. It's just Maxi Kleber. It's really frustrating because um, these silver Mosaics, just regardless of the player, just look amazing in my opinion. So when you get a, uh, a bit of a no-name like that, it's always frustrating. The potential of what that could be so great. Um, here's getting to our next pack. All right, I've got Brogdon and Josh Richardson there. The base of the Magic Johnson all time greats. So we did see the green earlier. And a bang, that's a nice one. Bang of Kyrie, Cavs vs. Warriors. Love this set so much. That's an awesome picture, too. My guy getting scored over, but that was a huge shot. I remember watching that game on telly. Um, there is a LeBron Cavs card, I believe. Uh, but man, that's nice. That's definitely reinvigorated. I haven't really hunted for any of the cards yet. I'm sort of just letting the market die down um, while the product's somewhat fresh, and then I'm going to go on a bit of a hunt. But yeah, that's, that's nice to get. I would love to see a silver mosaic, one of those two. All right, got Danny Green and Bagley. Got the Poku. I don't believe I have this actually. Poku base mosaic. So we'll take that. And then a green of KD. So not a bad player at all to get. That's cool. Two packs to go. We're getting an auto and a numbered card. Genesis. What do you reckon? Ja Morant. And then jo Big Jojo. Paul George National Pride for Aiden. And Hollow Fame of. Shaq. Don't really love these Hollow Fame ones, but it's alright. Decent player to get. Pop them down there. And last pack. So thanks for watching, guys. Bit of a fun battle, just a way to sort of pass the time. We are in isolation at the moment, so I figured we'd do something. And we've got a green just to cap things off. So there's Seth Curry, Jermichael Green, Finals MVP LeBron. That is a nice card. That would look cool in silver. Um, that sort of snuck up on me there. And what's our green? Brandon Ingram. So very bent. Last two cards there. Top loader should fix that, but extremely bent. I almost want to straighten them out, but um, pop the Brandon Ingram down. That's a cool card. The finals MVP. Got his trophies. Um, and on the back there, you can see how bent that is, eh? Like, <laughs> extremely. Anyway, I'll stop rambling on. We'll tidy up and we'll do a quick recap. All right, so we've tidied up a little bit. Time for a quick recap. We'll obviously go with our contenders first. It was the first box we opened. So we did get this red rookie of Udoka. And then just some inserts here and parallels. And as you can see there, there's another rookie card, but nothing too big at all. So I kept it pretty basic. Um, and that's sort of quite common with contenders retail. But we did manage to hit for our our guaranteed hit, we did get an auto, so we'll take it. Um, I've hit a Sam, I think Sam Merrill auto out of Contenders Retail before, um, and so yeah, at least Najee Marshall, I'm aware that he definitely has played for the Pelicans a fair bit. Um, so now nah, pretty cool, sticker auto, nice clean auto there though, and yeah, we'll definitely take it. So a rookie auto from a Contenders Blaster, um, they're pretty cheap products, so we'll, we'll, ta we'll take it. I think it's a pretty cool result. Um, so that definitely puts Contenders in good stead. So we'll just move them off the makeshift table for today. We then had hoops, so it's not really in any order, but
but the class of 2021 rookie insert for Mobley there, real cool card for sure. Uh, probably the hit of the box is this purple Josh Giddy, so that's uh, a real a real decent pull for sure. And then we've got another Mobley there, and a Kaminga base. The slam we got was the D Rose no ball. We did get this blue Kaminga too, which is a good result. Um, nice color match there on the Warriors uniform. And then we've just got some inserts and some other rookies. Obviously nothing numbered, but that's sort of the rest of the box there. Um, but as you saw there, probably two main hits being those uh, parallel, uh, sorry, your rookie parallels, and then you've got the slam, and then the Mobley insert too to take it home. So I think a real solid uh, when it comes to a hoops box there for sure. So I'll just move those as well. And then we had our mosaic. And probably the least, probably the most, probably underwhelming just in terms of, um, I don't know, in relation to a standard mosaic box. Um, didn't get any rookie parallels, I believe, um, but just some solid cool cards. So like I said, this LeBron here, uh, and then there's our sort of veteran parallels and inserts, sorry. Um, so there's an insert there, and then Jar. KD, that was a nice nice parallel to get for sure. Poku base rookie and this Irving Bang. But even those, you know, like, they're just pretty standard cards within the set. Did get this LeBron too. So we did get some, we did get looked after on the inserts for sure. Um, Magic Johnson parallel there. But just nothing big, you know. No, no Lamello, no Lamello color, all that kind of thing. But yeah, pretty darn solid in regards to those LeBrons. So that was it there. So yeah, thanks heaps for watching, guys. Let us know who you think think won. Really be keen to get some hobby product um, content, but you know you can only do what you can do. So hoping to get some mosaic cellos as well, and then we'll just see how the products go throughout the year. But yeah, thanks heaps for watching, guys. Cheers.